Josh, a difficult afternoon. Talk us through your feelings on that one. Yeah, it's <coughs> it's disappointing. Um, we weren't at it today. The quality wasn't there. Um, too easy the goals. Yeah, it's just one of them games where you know we got what we deserved. I think. Yeah, prior to today, Arsenal had scored 16 in four, six of them last week against West Ham. So they are difficult opponents and there's never an easy time to play a team that are in such strong form. Yeah, no, there's never an easy time to, to play these teams, especially, you know, the ones that we've played recently. Um, you know, the top, top team. But <clears throat> for us, we've shown that we can compete and, and do well and, and, and create chances. And today, I didn't really see any of that. Um yeah, we worked hard and, you know, that's a given anyway. Um, but overall, it's just a quality. With the ball, <coughs> without the ball, um, yeah, it's it's a tough one to take for sure. Yeah, and, and we've had Man City, Liverpool, um, Arsenal, all in quick succession. Today's bigger scoreline in comparison to those two, they were both 3-1. What was it, do you think, that did result in that bigger scoreline? What do you, do you think changed? Um we just probably gave them easy chances and the quality that they've got, um, the quality of the Premier League, they just take it. That's the difference. Uh, we had a few big chances over the last few games that we didn't take and, you know, the, the best teams do that um, and we haven't done that. Um, so, yeah, I feel, I feel like that was it. They created some really good chances, you know, probably looked really easy for them and people watching it and, like I say, it, it's not acceptable from us. I don't think this game's going to define our season. Um, it's one that we'll hold our hands up and take and it wasn't good enough um, but we've got a good run of games coming up where you know we've got to keep our heads up and, and go again because you know I still believe in this team everybody does we do have quality um, it's hard to look through that after after today but you know we'll, we'll, we'll keep being confident. Yeah, definitely. And, and we do have a, a very young squad in terms of learning like learning and development. You do want to be testing yourself against the best, best teams that there are. No, it is. It's the best league in the world and you know, we know that anyway, and we've definitely found out this year it's been a tough, tough season. Um, but we're not dead and buried. There's a chance for us. Like I said, there's a good run of games coming up, and there's no better time to, to put it right than the next game that comes our way. And, you know, hopefully we can we can pick up a run. Like I say, it's probably hard for people to look at that and think and be any positive. But for us, there is positive there. Um, there's confidence there still. And like I say, we'll reflect on this. Not good enough. Put it to bed and on to the next one. Yeah, and, and that next one is Crystal Palace uh, away next week. It's an opportunity to you know pick up some points. What's the plan heading into this week? What's the mindset going to be? Like I said, we just got to review that game, the the stuff that we can do better, and and work on that for for, for this week. And we've got a great chance to go away to, to Palace and put in a performance. Um, but it's Premier League. You can't expect any result in, in this division. And you know they're a good team, especially at home, and they've got some really quality players. Uh, so it's not going to be easy at all. So. It's one that we're going to have to have a big week um, and go into that game and, and get our confidence back and you know and that belief back and, and, and go and put on a show. Okay, thanks, Josh. Cheers.